and welcome back. We were on our way to Middenheim. I was considering or not to record the end turn sequence, but then I decided to do it simply because I don't really know what's going to happen when we hit our end turn button. So I think it is better to do it this way than than for me to tell you guys what actually happened when we hit the button. So let's check it out. Bada bam. Oh. Oh. Oh, well those were vampires there, and these are more vampires. Your right, so hold on, we'll deal with that in a second, so... Of your enemies, right, this is our objective, right? Them will know that fate is on your side. Hostile I hero activity, seen. settlement, Dam buildings damaged. Okay, our new objective is control 10 and get money, okay? What the heck happened here? This is a big stack. Um. Mm hmm. Manfred is coming. Manfred von Kastein is coming to mess us up. He is really close. Like, really close. We need to turn an... Uh, oh, we, we are actually... We are also at war with him. I'm kind of surprised. Right. We need to turn an army around and go and deal with that problem. They could hit that town though, they could hit Grimberg. It's that city and that city. We need to sort these vampires right out. Yeah, so I the more we keep going, the more I feel choosing to fight the north was a mistake on our part. That we will, that we should not have allowed to happen. The Empire. Can deploy a hero to get more public order. Good. I will not defile my faith. The Empire. We still in high public order. No, we're not. That's fine. That is because. Don't feel insulted. That will change over time. That's fine. We'll take this guy. I can't even see what's in this army. Take our boy and go here. Take up the pace. Hopefully, our friend von Karstein yes, my lord. Let us doesn't move. do anything over. Step the reason right. I moved the army away is because of when we select him, right? We can see his red zone here and here. We don't want him to be able to attack us in one fell swoop while we're in sta and march stance. <laughs> okay. But we made some money. Let's invest it up. Made some money there, some money there. Mm. We're not going to spend money to repair this building. There is zero point just now to spend money to repair this building. By the comet, ready. We need to move here and finish this 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 very quickly. My right. To move. Oh, that's Absolutely a big ass. Not. That's a lot of dudes there, y'all. That's a lot of dudes. Me my men. Not like we can me. siege that. So that's a 17 stack, and then he's got another 16 as garrison. Let's check what kind of garrison forces we're talking about. Shock, RT, RT. Yeah. So we really. We need to siege this. I am Prince and Emperor. Global recruitments on the encamped. We need to siege this down. What does the Emperor bid? What? Volify, I'm looking forward to you. 
Damage buildings, yes, I know, thank you. Moving on. Oh, he did as well. So he has skeleton zombies. Let's 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 look at these units for a second. Skeletons. So in the Warhammer games, when skeletons lose in the Warhammer tabletop to be specific, when skeletons lose leadership checks, they lose more men based on how badly they lost the leadership check. I assume that this is how they implement this in Total War Warhammer. Crumbling and disintegrate. Yes. Manfred himself. We're gonna hit him so hard in his teeth. It'll be amazing. We're gonna knock his fangs out. Zombies. Zombies are very low stat. Okay. They're also very slow. Skeletons are a little bit fast. They're not very good. Well, not much. A little bit better stat. They have spearmen flyers. Da 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 da. Manfred himself. Do we want to play in this battle to see if we can maximize damage on our friend Manfred before we lose this town? What I would very much like to do is nail one of these specialist units to not have to deal with it when our main stack walks down here. So I think that's why we'll do this battle because I want to get rid of hopefully one, preferably two stacks. of Manfred von Karstein. So, we see his army, we see that stuff is there. We can go here, uh-huh. I think we will, we'll fight them right here. Take this, go there. Swordsman in the middle. In the middle. Spearman to the side. To the side. Crossbows and lines. Let's begin this battle. We'll go at a higher speed to get the enemy to come to us. Actually. Now, let's do this even more old school. Let's take this army. Yeah, we'll take this army. It's not particularly nice, but we're going to do it anyway because I want to show you guys what this is. And go there, you see? If we're in this corner, we can't get surrounded. We can stack our lines and force them to fight in our front. To hopefully grind them down as hard as we possibly can. So while our, while our army is repositioning, their army is also doing something. Like this. Try to do four stack maybe? No. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a little C shape facing the corner. Like so. Like so. Like so. With the arches on the inside. Like so. Good. Go. Needless to say, this only works against the computer because the computer will run at you and try to do their best. In multiplayer, this is virtually worthless. We're going to toggle guard. So in guard stance, our men will win a fight. Well, actually, hopefully they don't at all move. So that, so that they don't dis, so that they don't, they don't break this formation around the corner, and endanger our crossbowmen. Let's do this with our crossbowmen. Let's speed this up again. Are they going to come towards us, those bats? I really hope so. I don't want to have to go there and re-trigger them. Uh-huh. Let's give this a couple more minutes. Oh, there we go. Here they come. 
Good, good, good. Let us see who the first set of victims are going to be. This is nice. I guess this is also going to be the first time we see a real undead army. I like how the skeletons walk in perfect sync. This is very, 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 very cliche, but it's also quite cool. Doop, 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 doop. Your hidden units have been revealed. Who would have guessed? Are we shooting them? Yes, we are. Great. The dire wolves. They're doing some spells, increased melee attack. Ooh, that could be quite scary. But again, we d we were always going to lose this fight. The only question is, how much can we get them to suffer to take this mystery? Hopefully, a lot. One cast iron doesn't have a lot of hit points, you know. Let's shoot him instead. Whoa, 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 whoa. He has 33 hit points remaining. I'm sorry. This is also a little bit of a low blow, but we're just going to shoot Manfred von Karstein. Because I think he just miscast the spell to do a whole bunch of damage to himself. He must have done. Let's see what happens. Ready for war. 20 hit points, 12, 10. Oh, look! Manfred von Karstein is dead! Well, that is wildly unfortunate for the enemy. Let's pause this. Let's have more focus fire from our crossbows. We need to eliminate with our crossbows the specialist units that will most annoy us in the next fight. Assuming that Manfred von Karstein doesn't come back to life again. Which he might do. I fully expect him to actually come back to life. We need to nail these flying bats. In fact, no. No, we don't. We will just set our archers to auto fire at the most most opportune target and let them f go free and do their thing. Some bats fighting archers, not very nice. Maybe shoot? Obscured by what? Oh, don't run! Claude, don't run! Oh well. I guess that is the end of the front line, my friends. Our army just could not stand up to the might of the undead. Although we'd really tried. Can we fire? We can fire, there we go. Yes, it would be very nice if my guys would shoot some arrows at the enemy. Or if I had like a couple of missiles to drop on top of them. Like wild space missiles and ion cannons. So, to be fair though, to be fair, that was probably... It depends if he comes back to life. Hopefully Manfred von Karstein doesn't come back to life. If he does, it's not that good. Hopefully he's out for a couple of turns and his army can't really do anything that interesting. But otherwise, I thought that was pretty good. Yes, we killed all of the bats. We killed one of uh, Manfred, and we killed one of the dogs. That was actually really good. So remember, we had level 2 buildings there. Let us find out if him raiding them 
destroys or unlevels our buildings. He took over the city. Oh no 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 he didn't. Let us we need to go deal with that problem right now. That is absolutely unacceptable. <laughs> absolutely unacceptable. Who was assassinated? What? What? Hold on a second. Eben was assassinated. Has wounded. Okay, he's wounded in Reichland assassination attempt. Hopefully, he comes back to life later. My friend. Yes, yeah, so Mr. Von Karstein is taking a break. While he's taking a break, the rifle army will move up and shoot them. A lot. We're not going to encircle. We have superiority. These are zombies and skeletons. There's a couple packs of dogs, but we'll deal with it. Let's begin this amazing fight, my friends. The problem is, is this terrain is not, is, is not to our benefit. There is a lot of hill, rolling hills and avenues of advance that would prevent us from delivering damage to their faces. What I'm thinking therefore is, is that we come over to this side of the map. Actually, no, not really. This is also not very good. I think we need to maintain this hillside and shoot them as they run over it. Otherwise, advance very, very slowly with artillery cover. And gunners, sound off. Yes, Spearman on the flank to deal with the dogs. Do Swordsman in the middle to charge through the front line. Ready. The leader in the middle. Artillery in the middle. I look forward to having tanks, by the way, undead friends. I look forward to having wild amounts of tanks. Spearman. We'll stagger these units. Deploy. So this is happening. We'll let them position. <laughs> yes, this is. We really should set up here. Actually, let's let's hold that for a second. We're going to reset up this deployment, right? Because if you look down here. They're coming at us, right? If you look down here, from the line of sight of our riflemen, there's this hill in the way, which is unacceptable. So we're going to move the riflemen forward here, so they can have a clean line of fire over there. This will be a another C-shape-esque looking thing, like so, and like so. Actually, probably more like so, so we need to stagger this a little bit more. We'll see how they actually how they end up advancing on us. To see if we need to stagger these firing lines more or not. Of course we're gonna put these guys here. Gonna stagger there and there. 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 All right. Artillery is not going to move because they're almost in artillery range. If I move the artillery now, the artillery would not get maximum time to fire for effect on the enemy. So we're not going to move the artillery pieces. I just really hope that my artillery does not get charged. If they do, then I'll so be it. Anyway, I'll pause. And the cannibals land. Where are those wild packs of dogs? 
There's one. There's one. I'm assuming the other one's over here and it's just out of my line of sight. So, because I do not want my rifleman to be on the receiving end of this nonsense. Right. Right. Right, like this. So we have opportunity to react. Pause. Otherwise, this is going to be undead open season. What's even well, actually, considering considering the way they're advancing, it might be worth for us to move our swordsman here. Now, this is cool because our rifleman will also just shoot clean over our swordsman. We're gonna make a mess of your army, my friends. Whoop. This we have to deal with. This is dangerous for my rifleman. Uh-huh. You're a wizard. You're a wizard, Harry! How good are you in combat, I wonder? Let's check it out. You're better than me in combat, you say. Or are you? I don't think you will be when I rush you down with my men. It's also hard to say. I need the charge bonus. Okay, let's do this. We're going to counter charge their general. With our general. And those guys. And we will trigger our hold line ability. Cannons actually need to do more work, not there, but really, like this is a this is a lot of skeletons, right? We need to break them into groups of two, and try to nail them. And this group try to nail them. He's also casting spells. That bastard. Okay, we'll also activate some spells. now we need to reorganize what my riflemen are doing if they pull back one hill they might be able to fire on still line we need to position like so to position that like so and then let's see what happens 
weapons. Zombies, zombies not very powerful, not really. So we might be able to beat them down. Let's continue the fight. I believe, friends, this is in the bag. I believe this is very much in the bag. Position the lines, the riflemen. No what do you bid? There's a time on that, so we can shoot them in the back. Yes, we Behind can begin fire. This is cleaning up, this is cleaning up. These rifleman units can reposition again. One of the biggest problems with this map is this approach in this wood. And these sort of rolling hills. It made things quite difficult to receive the press and deal with. I'm gonna use to go in and help that one. Good, good. Yep, there you go. They disappear. Everything's disappearing. The whole army falls apart. Good game. That was entertaining. That was quite entertaining, my friends. I enjoyed that a lot. Pretty sure Manfred did not enjoy that, seeing his army crumble so easily. We've done that. It was a decisive victory. We gained some money. And we gained a talisman. Right. We will occupy the settlement. Because this is our home. Fire resistance 30%. Okay, I've not seen too many things do fire other probably than our fire wizards. Province secured the Reichland. We can reissue commandments. I will marshal the bags. One percent of that. Eight percent of that. Mm. Okay, let us let us take a break here, my friends, and we'll see you in the next video.